<laughs> you know what? <laughs> They've got a lot going on this weekend, and it's going to be a really good weekend to get out, play some football, play some soccer, or virtually whatever you want to do. I found myself apologizing for last weekend quite a bit because of kind of the gray and cool nature of it. There will be no apologies issued this weekend. I'll show you why in a moment. Take a look at what we did today. Big spread in temperatures. We had everything from some 60s up towards the north and out towards the coast. We saw that marine layer cloud cover push in earlier. There's going to be more of that overnight tonight, but wow, mid 80s, 84 Seattle, 84 Chehalis, and a couple of 86s tucked in there. Not bad. We've backed it off beautifully into a really nice range now. If you were thinking about heading out for a stroll, this is the time. Take a look at this. We've got some temperatures that are in the mid 50s in Oak Harbor. I don't know if I'm buying that. 59 in Port Angeles, and I'm definitely buying what we're seeing down towards the south. 73s currently in Olympia and in Chehalis. Over the next 12 hours, we will cool, but not a whole lot. In fact, we'll touch down right around 60 degrees. And as I mentioned earlier, you'll notice, especially near waterways, we're going to see some of that marine layer cloud cover to start the day off. And then as the day progresses, it will clear beautifully. Here, I've put together a presentation. As we put this into motion, we'll see a lot of that mid and upper level cloud cover ignore the blips and blops. There is the potential for some very light, and I do mean very light drizzle right along the immediate coast there, but then once we progress into the day, sun comes out, whew, most of that will take off. Now, the big difference between today and tomorrow is that you'll notice that some of that marine layer cloud cover will hang near the coast there, but still, it's going to be a pretty nice day there as well. And this will be something that we'll do over the next couple of days. We'll kind of see that ebb and flow that pulls that cloud cover in, but then as soon as the sun gets on it, it's going to melt almost immediately. Overnight lows will be comfy tonight. We're going to be talking about some mid 50s in some spots, upper 50s in Seattle and Renton. Wow, well played. 58 out towards Hoquiam and 53 for our friends in Port Angeles. And if you're wondering what tomorrow looks like, again, another gorgeous day. We'll see a lot more mid 80s and some even lower 80s out there than we saw today. So very similar, but just maybe a degree or two cooler. Take a look towards Puyallup and Yelm. We've got some 82s there. 81 in the state capital tomorrow and out near the coast. Again, marine layer cloud cover will keep it slightly cooler. So we'll be seeing some 60s right along the coast. But as soon as you head inland, 80s in Chehalis. And if that's not enough for you, head over to the Tri-Cities. They're breaking into triple digits tomorrow. Yakima, not far behind at 99. Seven-day forecast shows us in the upper 50s overnight tonight. 81 on Thursday. I'm liking that. And then this weekend, okay, slightly cooler. We'll be 76 on Saturday, 80 on Sunday. Still a lot better than last weekend. And if you like it hot, hang out. Gets into the upper 80s and lower 90s Tuesday and Wednesday.